In this illustration, we intend to calculate the period of mass spring system in the Abacus software. As you observe in the picture, the stiffness of spring is equal to 400 newton per meter, and the concentrated mass is equal to 2 kilograms. In this problem, the period of mass spring system is first calculated using the analytical solution. Following that, it is calculated using the Abacus software. And finally, the results obtained from the Abacus software will be compared with results of the analytical solution. I will enter the Abacus software for simulation. I will click on Create part. Here, I intend to create a geometric shape of mass spring. I will select the modeling space as three-dimensional, from here deformable, then select point, enter approximate size equal to one, and continue. Here I will create the geometric shape of spring using two points. First, uh, we should define these two points here. I will enter the first point equal to zero, zero, zero. Uh, to create the second point, I'll click on Tools menu, then select Datum. From here, select Point and then Offset from Point. Select this point and enter Offset equal to 0, uh, negative 0 0.1 meters and 0. Here, these two points can be observed. In the next step, I will enter property module. Here, we don't need to define a material, so I will directly enter assembly module, click on create instance, and OK. In the next step, I'll enter step module. Click on create a step. Here, select dynamic explicit, continue. Enter a time period equal to 3 seconds, then here I will select Fixed option, then select User Defined Time Increment option, enter a time increment equal to 0 0.01 seconds, and OK. In the next step, I'll enter Interaction module. Click on Tools menu, select Reference point, then select this point. Here, we should define the spring in the Abacus software. I'll click on Special, then select Springs, Dash Pots, and Create. I will select Connect Two Points option. First, I'll select this point, then this one, done. As you observe in the picture, stiffness of spring is equal to 400 newton per meter. Here, I'll enter the stiffness of spring equal to 400 newton per meter and OK. In the next step, I'll click on Special menu, then select Inertia and Create. Here, select Points, Mass, Inertia and Continue. I will select this point, Done. Here, the concentrated mass is equal to 2 kilograms. OK. In the next step, I'll enter Load Module. Uh, here, click on Create Boundary Condition. Select Initial Step. Then select Displacement Rotation. Continue. Select this point. Done. And then close all boundary conditions of displacement. In the next step, I'll click on Create Load. Select Step 1. Then select Gravity. Continue. Here, I will enter acceleration of Earth gravity equal to negative 9.881 meters per squared second and OK. In the next step, I'll return to step module. Click on Field Output Manager. Edit. Here, uh, enter the number of outputs equal to 150 and OK. After that, I'll enter Mesh module. 
here we don't need meshing so i'll go to job module click on create job continue ok and click on submit The analysis was done successfully, so I'll click on Result. Here you observe the deformation of the spring. The purpose of this problem is to calculate period of the mass spring system. We use this formula in order to calculate the period of the mass spring system. And as you observe, the period of mass spring system is dependent on the concentrated mass and stiffness of spring. Here, the mass is equal to 2 kilograms and the stiffness of spring is equal to 400 and newton per meter. And according to this formula, uh, the period of mass spring system is equal to 0 0.444 seconds. Now, uh, here we intend to calculate the mass spring system period using the Abacus software. Here, the initial state of mass spring system has been distinguished with black color and the deformed model displayed with green. Here, we should calculate the period of the model. The period is the time it takes for the system to make one complete swing, or in other words, the time it takes for the system to return to its initial state. Here, as it can be observed, the period having been obtained from the Abacus software is equal to 0.44 seconds. And as you observe, the period gained from the analytical solution is equal to 0.444 seconds. And that obtained uh, from the Abacus software is equal to 0.44 seconds. Comparing the results obtained from the Abacus software with those of the analytical solution, we will notice that the results obtained from the Abacus software are very close to those of the analytical solution. Here, 
we can also use another way for calculating the period of system. I will click on create exploit data, select ODB field output, continue. Uh, here, select unique nodal, then select U2. From here, select this point and click on save. Here, you observe the vertical displacement of the system. Here, in order to calculate the period, we'll only need to calculate the time taken for a complete oscillation to be carried out. Here, we can calculate the distance between two similar points. And here, you can observe the manner of calculating the period in this picture.